Hey guys, welcome to another Clean With Me video. Guys, today we're going to be tackling so much. We're going to be just tackling disgusting bathrooms, decluttering, doing the floors, all the things. If you guys don't know who I am, my name is Rebecca Joe, and I am a mom of two teen boys, two dogs, a cat, and I have a husband. And we all know that the struggle is real keeping the house clean. So today, cram-packed full of cleaning motivation. I also want to give my friend a shout out Alicia Lurie guys go check out her YouTube channel at Alicia Lurie um, so much cleaning motivation over there so much organization if you guys love organization you're gonna get that over there make sure to go check her out let's jump right into this video As we're sitting here in silence so here we're starting in the bathroom guys like this bathroom is so bad and any of you moms who have boys just in general know that boys can be pretty messy and the bathrooms I swear I dread them <laughs> I dread it because they're always so gross like there's just pee everywhere <laughs> and there it's just it's gross it's really gross so this bathroom needs some major help like look at this like it's so gross so we're gonna jump in and make sure that we get all of this clean you guys are gonna see me actually using bleach spray so I use the bleach spray in the bathrooms hands down I'm telling you because I have teen boys I have to use bleach in these bathrooms um, I also wanted to point out there is a little hair <laughs> that you guys are seeing over here um, I don't know what happened we have two dogs and there's hair everywhere all the time. And so I'm sorry about that. <laughs> I cleaned the whole bathroom before I realized it was there. So that's just kind of dangle in there for you guys to just, I guess, have a little extra. And also here I'm using the Sprayway glass cleaner for the countertop spray. It works great. Um, it's not my choice. I looked and I cannot find my countertop spray anywhere. So this is what I'm using. Look at my face here. This is when I discovered that there was disgusting stuff in the bottom of this toothbrush holder. <laughs> Guys, having boys is just, it's, it's something else. Okay, we love them, but they are so gross. <laughs> So you'll have to drop your favorite glass cleaners down in the comments for me. This is my absolute favorite glass cleaner. It's called Spray Away. You can get it now at Walmart, Sam's Club, all the things. Guys, this glass cleaner makes your mirrors look so good. I know it's hard for you to give it a try, but you are not alone. I'm here with you. I think so some people like to use paper towels or whatever on their toilets. I use a certain rag that goes specifically for the toilets um, because they have like fibers that actually grab stuff. So you may notice I actually switched my rag. I normally use two to three rags on the toilet. <laughs> I have a special cleaning rags that I use for the bathrooms only because they're disgusting.
so this toilet is so gross you guys um so it actually has hard water that is now down in the hole so basically um to get rid of that you guys can actually take um some white vinegar and some baking soda and let that soak real good in the toilet um, if you can let it soak for several hours let it um, and it'll actually break up that hard water so that's what I'm going to do to this toilet but not in the video so who else steam mops their floors I like to steam mop the bathroom floor that is where I think most germs collect so even though I go through and I kind of wipe the floors I also will steam mop them to make sure they get a very good deep sanitized clean and I also wanted to point out that this bathroom needs we major remodeling um, and that is our next remodel project coming up so you guys stay tuned for that because there's going to be lots of remodeling happening in here something changed yeah and I know, I know, I know, I sometimes drive you crazy. Yeah, I know, I know, I know, I sometimes drive you crazy. And I think that's why you've been building up this wall now. Let me know down in the comments. These are a couple of the ideas that I have for the upcoming remodel for the bathroom. What do you guys think? What is your opinions? Give me all of the details, all the new remodel ideas that you guys have. Send them this way for sure because this bathroom needs it. Now we're going to hop on over to the living room. This living room is a disaster, guys. Like, look at this. Like, what in the actual... <laughs> I have no idea how it got this bad, but we are going to get it taken care of right now. How many know that the struggle is real with these pack and plays like <laughs> you have to like bend it just right and then like uh maneuver it and then bend the other arm and oh my gosh <sighs> and this pack and play the bedding on it is all messed up i need to get a new one so yep gonna get these pack and plays and just go put them up and get them out of the way so some of you may know i have an in-home daycare that's why i have pack and plays that's why i have a changing table in the middle of my living room um, and the cubbies on the wall um, so I do work Monday through Friday for an in-home daycare so that is what you're seeing when you see all of this stuff this wall now and I don't really know how I'm supposed to break it down you should let me So you'll see that I actually have a sheepskin rug hanging over a piece of my sofa right here. So there has just been a lot of wear and tear on the sofa. I need a new sofa. Um, I've had this sofa for over 10 years probably, maybe 6 years. Um, it's been a while. So to keep daycare kids from tearing it up more, I just put that over it for now. Um, I have a sofa cover coming soon, so soon that will be covering it instead. Sometimes we just do what we have to do to make do, right?
this little TV stand, this is where we obviously keep all of our electronic stuff. Um, and you see that mess of cords? Yeah. So we just had our TV service that was switched over and I realized that behind here was a hot mess express. <laughs> So I was like, I'm pulling that out and I'm going to clean back there. And boy, did it need it. There was toys back there, dust bunnies, you name it. And then I went and dumped the plant on top of everything. So I had to clean that up. But hey, I had my vacuum right there. So um, I actually decided I was going to organize all these cords. And my husband actually got this little thing. I think he said he bought it at Lowe's. Um, but you can get them like at Home Depot. I think maybe Walmart is, even has them, but they're cord hiders. And you actually just stick all your little wires down inside of there and it hides all the wires. So it goes from looking like Hot Mess Express to looking so good. So this is a good way for you to hide your cords if you need to do that. So now I'm just going to go ahead and dust everything off really good. Just make sure everything is nice and clean. And then I'm going to hit these blinds. So whenever I dust normally, guys, I always go over the blinds. Um, I like to keep down on the dust because when dust builds up on blinds, it is no fun. So I just get that while I'm here every single time. I recall it still in my bed of truck. I didn't look back. I got my first real kiss behind the coffee shop Thought he was the one until we broke it off I recall it still in his bit of truck Yeah, I cried like hell Then I told him off Or I would never come back to this town But now I'm here So this vacuum, you guys, oh my gosh, I love this vacuum. So this is actually a shark and I forget what model it is, but so I have been through so many vacuums in my lifetime and this one I've had for longer than I've had that sofa sitting there. Um, so over six years for sure. And you know how like you'll have a vacuum cleaner and it'll give you good carpet lines for a little while. And then after a while, it just doesn't work the same, no matter what. Um, this one has continued to give me um, those carpet lines. It gets dog hair, it gets all the dust, all the things. I love this vacuum cleaner.
So as you can see, I can actually take it apart so easily and just use the hose and there's different links that I can use on it. This thing, I can actually take it apart, all the way apart and get, like if anything gets stuck in the hose, it's so easy to get out. Um, I just love this thing. Like it is very, very handy. Damn, my heart still beats for the place where I grew. I was yours for the taking Guess I needed a home But I found I'm mistaken so here I'm actually just tucking in these cords. So ours is like electric couches, like, you know, you can plug them into the wall or whatever. We don't have them plugged into anything. We actually moved the sofa a lot so we can work out, so we can spread out, you know, in the living room. And those cords are always coming out of there. It's such a pain. So I pointed this out in my last video. There's lots of spots that you're seeing like where the floor doesn't meet quite up with the tile, different things like that. And we actually are in the middle of a remodel in this house. So there's lots of areas that need improvement. My husband is getting ready to actually work on getting the wood floor embedded right up to that tile to where it has a nice clean um, transfer. So. And um, that's what you're seeing when you see different areas of this house that just need improvements. We're getting there slowly but truly and soon it'll be completely done. Cause you can handle emotions, uh, so you wanna talk again, but it's time to do this my way. Guys, this vacuum, I actually uh, talked about this in my last video. So this is the Bissell Wet Vac. This thing is so amazing. Um, so it actually vacuums and mops at the same exact time and gets your floors so clean. Um, the floors dry super fast, so I don't have to worry about like, you know, waiting for them to dry for a long time. I, our house is kind of small and so everybody's always walking on the floor before it even dries. It's like, come on people. So this actually dries really quick um, and it just runs so smooth. So you can see that the water actually goes in the back. Um, so it's partial water and then partial the cleaner and there's different cleaners for like sanitization, different ones for pets, things like that. Guys, this thing is amazing. Um, check it out. It is going to be linked in the comments for you guys so that you guys can go get you guys one of these. Saves time. Battery life lasts forever. It is cordless. It's amazing. So that's going to pretty much wrap up this clean guys. I'm going to start putting everything back together and just straightening everything up and then we are done with this clean. So this was a lot of work, a lot of work today, but look at the results of this. I mean, it started out so bad and now it's so clean and it always is good to just have that feeling of ah, it's 
done, right? Like we all love that feeling. So this is so nice and I'm gonna go sit back, probably have a glass of wine and just enjoy my nice clean home. I hope that you guys enjoyed all of this content here today. We're gonna be providing a lot more content to come. Make sure that you guys are subscribing to the channel Go ahead and like this video and give it a thumbs up if you liked the video and make sure to leave me a comment. I like to come back and say hello to all my viewers. I hope that you guys have a fantastic week. I love all of you and we'll see you on the next one.